want to create another permission set on top of it let's click on this new button please remember one thing here that a permission set required a license so let me create a permission set called um, assign create a report permission definitely the name um, of the permission set should be something like you know which should be easily understandable right so i have created a permission set called assign create report permissions and this time i'll make sure that the permission set license is salesforce because you know right the based on the license that you select you can do things inside the org so if you select salesforce license uh, for that particular permission set then you as an admin can define any sort of permission in that permission set because salesforce license had have like every single thing correct so i'll just click on the save button now look at this page this page uh, looks like little different than the profile page right that's a different view by the way but here in this page in the permission set page you can actually assign exactly same thing same permissions that you can give access in the profile level right so we have something called assigned app so here if you go to this assigned app then you'll be able to see all the application that has uh, been onboarded inside the org all the standard and custom application and you can give whatever application access that you want to give to this permission set right we can do the same thing in the profile if you remember profile also had the same page if you go to the profile here also you'll see the same custom app setting which is nothing but the applications that you want to give access to this particular profile right so permission set as i said can give pretty much everything that you can do in the profile so assign apps assign connected apps we'll discuss about this connected app in the uh, developer session because this is something you need in the integration object setting um, section where you as an admin can go and say okay for account object i'm going to give read access for this particular uh, for this particular permission set right so if you go to the object setting you will see the same objects let's say um, account i want to give read access to this permission set so just click on the account and you'll see all the several check boxes like read write and all the several check boxes here you as an admin click on this edit button and give whatever access that you want to give uh, for this particular account object let's say i want to make sure the tab account tab is uh, available in this permission set check this box i want to make sure that the uh, read and create access is available for this account right so i have given this and these are the field permissions so these are the field that we have inside the account object whatever field you want to give access like read or edit whatever you can give over here so this is pretty much object setting which again same thing that we have done so far in the profile level can be done here object setting then we have apex classes right uh, we'll be learning about apex classes in the developer part so if you have any apex specific apex classes right that you want to give access right or maybe visual force pages external data flow we will learn about flow in the automations so if you have any specific flow that you want to give access then you can give over here so these are the pretty much uh, the options the accesses that is available for you as an admin to assign in the permission set page the most important part in the permission set is what is this system permission these are the um, the administrative level permission that you had seen in the profile correct so if you go to the system permissions what was our requirement our requirement was rajesh should be able to um, create and customize dashboard so what i'm going to do is um, so again same thing right this is what the shortcut that i used to um, use in my project right so if i have to do something related to um, report what i do is i go to the same page and search with r e p o r t correct so you'll get every single um, option that you have in the profile same option you'll get over here so i'm selecting this option called create and customize report so this option if i check if this checkbox is checked in this permission set then anybody who holds this permission set even though he or she doesn't have access in the profile level to create and customize report still he or she will be able to create and customize report why because this permission set have this checkbox true and the same permission set has been assigned to that user simple i'm going to save this 